Hey guys, welcome back. So I thought since we did the Rags to Riches challenge in The Sims 1, it would be really cool to see for comparison how much easier it is in The Sims 4. That's my cat behind me. That's Lucy. Here's Frank and Beans. So I gave her a few traits and attributes based off how our gameplay went in The, same, in the Sims 1. She does have the blue t-shirt, the blue jeans, the earrings, the blonde hair. I gave her the deviance attribute, or aspiration, I should say. Uh, she's also a slob, based off of how gross her lot was in The Sims 1. I made her evil, and then I also made her erratic. Uh, so she'll talk to herself. Like, that's what I'm doing right now. But anyway... So we're going to just move into an empty lot in Willow Creek. We are going to start the exact same way with no house and no remaining funds. It says we'll have $18,000 left over, but actually once we move in, it should say zero. There it goes. It took the extra money away. First things first, we're going to look for a job. A couple of options we have are astronaut, athlete, business, criminal, there are a few in here. There's also like a few in here that make like a little bit more money, but I don't know how easy it is to get promoted in those industries because I've never done them. We could actually give this a try. Manual labor pays $45 an hour. Let's see if anything else pays more. Okay, manual labor does pay the most. We will start tomorrow at 7 a.m. So in the meantime, since we have no money, we're actually going to go fishing. You can fish in the in the Sims 4, which is a great skill, I guess, to have. You can also cook these fish as well, too, I'm pretty sure. But you can also sell these fish to make money as well. Try fishing elsewhere until she has more skill or try using valuable bait. Okay, so... So she's not a great fisher. And the welcome wagon is here. There's Bella. She's been reincarnated, I guess. If you don't know what I'm talking about, check out my Rags to Riches 3 video from The Sims 1. Bye. You won't be clapping in a minute, girl. We're not going to talk to her because she probably holds a grudge. Invite neighbors in? Where? Where are we inviting them in? That's what I want to know. We'll do it anyway. Make an enemy? And flirt with self? <laughs> okay. So how do we earn rewards? Okay, so Villainous Valentine. Get caught cheating, achieve X status with other sims, and break up couples. Great! This sim is naked. Well, almost. Okay. I've never even seen her before. So who's in a relationship in this game? This is like these Sims, Summer and Liberty, and then Travis here are all a part of the same household. I don't think any of them are in a relationship together, though. Jeffrey Langrab, come back. I know he's in a relationship. We could break. Come back. There he comes. Uh, Achieve X status with other Sims, get caught cheating, and break up. How do you break? You I remember. Never mind. Okay, goodbye, welcome wagon. I'm you guys need to go home. What is she mad about? And Jeffrey left. And there is my fruit cake. <sighs> I guess I'll put it in my inventory. I think the only thing that gets on my nerves about these things is whenever you go from build mode or go from lot to lot and then go back into life mode, it always pops the challenge back up in the upper right hand corner. I'm sorry, in the upper left hand corner. Ew! 
Okay, so then should I just be mean to her? Because we want to be mean. What's this? Make an enemy. Oh, that will be easy. And then flirt with self. Which I'm not sure how to flirt with myself. But we can be mean to Summer. Insult face. Mock outfit. Trick with hand buzzer. Can you leave? Send home. Goodbye. Let's insult her outfit again. I don't. I didn't. Rem I didn't see that. Dang. Okay, she's not even that mad. That's an ugly outfit. Was she wearing Sperry's? Well, I'm wearing. <laughs> well, I'm wearing socks with sandals, so I really can't talk that much. Oh, it's Nancy Landgrab. Nancy. Come here, I want to be mean to you. Well, maybe I could uh, come back. I could break them up and I can have an affair with her and then I could also have an affair with Jeffrey. It's going to be really hard to make friends in this too because I made her so evil. Uh, dang it. She does not like us. Okay, you can leave. Goodbye. Eat this. Take a piece. I'm gonna already pee myself. I don't know if the evil aspiration is gonna, or the trait's gonna work out for us. Because it's gonna be really hard for her to make friends and get, break up other couples. So talk to yourself. Do you get social from that, I wonder? There goes another land grab. Okay, let's go find a bathroom. We'll go to the library. Oh, right now I just have the base game installed. Um, I disabled a couple of my packs. Uh, that way it would be a little bit harder. Because there are, I feel like, other things in that come along with the other packs that make this challenge a little bit easier. So I didn't want it to be too easy. Okay, can you use the restroom please? Thank you. Well, at least we got the fruitcake from the welcome party. We won't starve to death and then we can always come here and use the restroom and wash our hands. Oh, flirt with self. There we go. Flirt with self. That's still on there. Yes. Okay. Now I want to read something. She's washing her hands with her gloves on. Okay. Let's read a book. I think we'll just nap here because we can't I wish if that's one thing I wish they would do is to update the game so you could take more than just a nap on a couch or an ottoman I mean I've how many times have you like fallen asleep on your couch at home while you're watching tv and slept there all night I know I have so then basically what you just have to do is just go through here and hit nap a million times because they only nap for like an, a couple hours at a time They'll get up, they'll try to do something else, but if you have it like set to nap, 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 they usually lay there for like a little bit longer. We're pretty well rested, so I think we're gonna stop and then we're gonna eat that fruit cake. Does it tell you how many? Five pieces left! This is gonna get us, oh my god. Did we miss work? Oh my gosh, I took a job that you only work two days a week at. No wonder it pays so much money. 
Oh no, we gotta get another job. I didn't realize that. I thought those were our days off. You're joking, right? No, I thought for sure. Okay, let's go home. And then we're gonna have to get like an actual job. Get off the computer, please. I can't. Oh no, that was goofy. I was like, why are we headed to work yet? I thought it said Saturday. Yeah, it said Saturday at 7 a.m. I thought it said Monday at 7 a.m. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, the great thing about this, though, is that you don't have to wait for a newspaper to be delivered uh, to find a new job, and there's more than one option available. Um, I guess we'll see what the second highest paying job is, because, like, $90 a week is not gonna cut it. I mean, we even made $90 a day in The Sims 1. Okay, well... Nine dollars an hour to be a criminal. Hmm. I think I want to do culinary. Wait, is this also two days a week? Or those are days off? Okay, hang on a second. Let's see. I don't know. I think. Let's see. Okay, I quit my job. And then I start tomorrow. Okay, yeah, so this is like the weekends off, which is kind of weird for the restaurant industry. But anyway, I guess we'll go over here and try to fish again to see if like we could catch anything to sell. I cannot believe that. I was trying to make her live off of $90 a week. You know, anything's possible, I guess, but I'm trying to be a millionaire. Yes, you like fishing, because we're gonna make you do a lot of it. Okay, can you fish again, please? Did you catch anything? No, not unless you count the fruitcake, which, <laughs> no. Are you more likely? Uh, okay, so I caught a Tetra worth $8. That's a, that's a good start. And we're already, ooh, I got a plumbing upgrading part. And I'm already at level two for fishing. Okay. So she has to use the restroom again. Oh, we're gonna dig. We can dig for frogs and like other collectibles. And she's eating, she loves that fruitcake. That's so weird because I've never had a sin that actually loves fruitcake. They all usually hate it. Oh wait, yeah, she hates it. She was just starving, I think. She really has to pee. Why do they all hate the fruitcake? Like, why do your neighbors bring fruitcake? Like, what happened to a pie or a casserole or something? I just think it's so weird. It's always been fruitcake too, hasn't it? Like, I think in The Sims, yeah, in The Sims 2 it was fruitcake too. Um, That's just funny to me and they always hate it. Okay, what did I find? A ruby. It's not that... Oh, it's not that rare, so we're going to sell it because it's $30. We're also going to sell the upgrade parts that we got, too, just because we don't have anything to upgrade. And we're going to sell the fish. All right, $68, closer to our goal of a million dollars. I do know that there are a few collectibles over here in this neighborhood. I'm going to probably... Oh, I, I can't even look for anything because I'm too uncomfortable. Okay, let's go use the restroom first, and then we'll come back, and we will look for some more collectibles. This time we're gonna go to the gym. Yes, I know you have to pee, so like, go pee. Is there an upstairs? Okay, there is. Oh my gosh, wait. I thought there were showers here too, I guess not. It's kind of weird. Oh, there is a shower. I'm blind, I thought that was a door. I guess we could go ahead and shower too. I mean, her, I mean, their needs decay so much slower. Like, it's already Monday. It's already been 24 hours. We haven't starved to death. Our bladder is fine because we can visit other lots. I mean, our hygiene, it's not even halfway. It's been 24 hours. I mean, might as well take a shower. Okay, go home, please. I swear to God, it never fails that she just throws something on her lot. Why? Why are you so messy? Oh yeah, 
Oh yeah, you're a slob. That's right. Will be... Always will be a slob. Go to fishing together with who? Jeffrey? Okay, sure. Funny, I caught a goldfish. I don't know if Jeffrey will appreciate a joke about a politician. Let's see, I caught a goldfish. And I caught an amethyst. That was probably worth $30, too. Oh, it's uncommon. It's a little bit more rare than the uh, ruby was. I'm catching more fish now. Bright and day. Discuss interests. How is your cue full? Talk to Jeffrey. And a $12 beta. I'm going to... How's that only worth $12 if it's uncommon? $7. An amethyst. Okay, cool. $142. So I think the goal is to have a million dollars, not earn a million dollars. So we have to be really careful about where we spend our money, what we spend it on. So once we do have a few dollars, I think once we get a house, it's gonna be like a micro home and then that way we're able to kind of save our money so we can hit that million dollar mark a lot easier instead of spending it on things. She just keeps eating that fruit cake. Okay, can you stop fishing, please? Because I'm trying to flirt with you. I'm trying to break up your marriage. Can you please acknowledge me? Okay. Mm-hmm. I can, I can see. You can do push-ups. That's great. Okay, can you talk to me now? I don't know if I should discuss my interests with him. He might think I'm a little weird. <laughs> Deep conversation. There we go. Deep conversation. Deep conversation. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Yeah, you didn't like the fruitcake. I don't know why you keep eating it. Okay, where is our relationship at? <sighs> We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to change her, her, um, some of her personality traits because I don't think that she's gonna make friends and be able to get very far. What did I say that made him so mad? Uh, can I just tell jokes? Just tell jokes. Everyone's more attractive when they tell jokes. When they're funny. He didn't like that. I can feel myself getting angry. I'm having flashbacks. Ask about career. Ask about favorite color. Ask about hobbies and skills. Ask about taste in music. He's a detective. He likes the color brown and the violin. He dislikes spooky music, and he does not like us. Oh, my gosh. Okay, we're going to have to. I'm, I got to I gotta change her, her traits. I got to change her traits. Hold on. Okay, we're back. We have MC Command Center installed. I think I had a few other um, mods installed in my game that I actually took out before I started this Let's Play. So we're actually going to take away her evil trait because it's really annoying. Okay, let's give her a different one. Um, we don't like that. Okay, since we're trying to get rich, we're going to give her the fortune. Uh, fabulously wealthy. Biggest fancy soul. Nope, we just want to be rich. Um, let's see. It won't let us change these other ones. I thought you were able to change those too. Dang, okay. Okay, I figured it out. So you want to type in testing cheats on, and then you're gonna type in, I haven't done this in a really long time. I usually do builds, I don't do let's plays. It's cast.fulledit mode. 
Okay, that should work. And then we'll go to MC Command Center, and then we should be able to modify uh, her traits. Yeah, baby, yes, okay. Great. So we have fabulously wealthy, and then we're able to modify these traits. Yay. I think she should stay erratic and slobby. I don't think she should be evil. Mm, maybe she should just be gloomy instead. That might give us a better chance. Let's see. Okay, we'll just make her materialistic. <laughs> Okay, hopefully this will help a little bit better and help us make friends a lot easier. Because he was not enjoying any of that conversation. Let's apologize. I mean, I'm still going to break up his marriage. Because I don't like him. <laughs> I just think he's an asshole. Why doesn't he like us? Okay, bye. Oh my gosh. Literally, he bored us to death. Good God. I can't. I don't like him. One thing I think they should also add in the base game. Now, this is something they're able to do in the werewolves pack is to sleep on the ground. I don't understand why people can't do that. I'm sure. It, I mean, I've slept on the ground before. Um, I don't understand why you just can't do it in the base game while werewolves are only be able to do it. Uh, being a werewolf and doing like a rags to riches challenge would probably be the easiest, to be honest. Because you can uh, urinate on the floor, you can sleep on the ground, you can eat objects like stairs and um, bookcases. You can basically just eat about anything except for like other animals and people. It's a very helpful pack to have whenever you're doing like a rags to riches challenge like this. She passed out <laughs> before work. That's great. Just make sure you wake up in time, okay? We're back from work. We earned $128. I'm gonna see if there's anything we can buy as far as like a toilet or anything. Uh, or even a pea bush. They do make a pea bush. We can buy a cot. How much is it? Okay, that's almost all of our money. Well, I'm gonna buy the bed because we still have fruit cake left. Fruit cake left over that we can eat, and I think that a good night's sleep is super important. Okay, let's see if there's anything that we need to get promoted. Prepare. Prepare food and mix drinks. Okay, that's not necessary, I think, to get promoted. I just think it's super helpful. Okay, why are you taking a nap? Why don't you take a regular... Oh, admire new possession. Do that first. What does that do? She wants to get some sleep. That will... Okay. Now you can go to sleep. Thank you. Wake up and have a piece of fruitcake. Okay, and go back to sleep, please. We might have a pretty good day tomorrow. Our performance isn't excellent, but it's not dismal. What's this? Leftovers? Yeah, okay. Take a piece. Hopefully we'll start work soon before we pee ourselves and we can pee at work. Oh, we might make it. How many pieces do we have left? Okay, we are officially out of fruitcake. So, and she peed herself. Okay, well, when we get back, we'll go to the gym and we will take a shower because we're probably about to start work, yes? I think we go in at nine. Okay, yeah, so we have like one more hour before we have to be at work. I do not miss the carpool from The Sims 1. I just think it was really annoying. I'm just glad they kind of go to a rabbit hole. If you have the Get to Work expansion pack, you can go to work with your Sim. Like, if you're a detective, it's super interactive. I did do that once. It was actually a lot of fun. Okay, and we got a promotion. That was fast. Okay, did we get a bonus? Um, Received the following bonus. Oh, I got a countertop and $334. And then I go back to work tomorrow at 9 a.m. Okay, cool. The worst thing about... 
usually getting promoted is that you'll start your new position like almost immediately um like especially like in the criminal um field you like I know one time I specifically like had a job and then like I had to be at work like an hour later after I got promoted and had to go to work on zero sleep so to find the countertops that we got you just go into build mode and then you'll go into inventory and we got three of them Oh, we might sell some of these because who needs three countertops? Oh, yeah. Let's buy a refrigerator. Um, okay, food quality three. Well, how much is this? 600 and new. We'll just get this one. That color is ugly. That's a little better. Okay. All right. Do we have enough money for an oven? We only need one countertop. $400, still not enough money. A toilet. Freestanding toilet. Oh yeah. Um, you know what? I think I'm gonna sell this. And then, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I might sell the toilet. I think the shower's more important to me right now. Cause I think we could buy a pea bush. Let's see. There's my shower. And then let's see. I wasn't able to find the bush because I don't think it's in the base game. If I'm wrong, let me know. I kind of looked everywhere and I wasn't able to find it. But like I said, the shower is more important to us right now. And we still have $137 left. So let's take a new shower. It, oh, admire. Does that do anything? Buy a chess table. Earn. $100. Can, let's lock that one because that will be easy. Have some fun. We'll play some. What's cool about this is you can play video games on your phone. And she is not having a good time. Okay, play some games. Let's see. Entertainment. Play game. Yes, she loves video games. That did absolutely nothing for our fun. Let's try it again. <sighs> We're gonna have to try to find somewhere to eat. Or you could sleep, that's fine too. Somewhere to eat. I forgot we put a refrigerator in here. We can have a snack. We can also cook a fruit or a garden salad. I can't. Fruit salad. I think that's for breakfast. The fruit salad is. What was that? Um, it's almost as if someone else is controlling her life. Will Franken finally fulfill her dreams, or is whoever controlling her life stop her wishes from coming true? Hmm, no, we're trying. We really are. Hurry up. To get a promotion to the next level is to reach cooking skill uh, two. That's a promotion task. We've already gotten one cooking skill point from the salad that we had for dinner. And so we're going to have some salad for breakfast. Um, there's also daily tasks. I've never really noticed that if you get promoted faster or not uh, doing these daily tasks related to your particular career field, uh, but we could definitely try them. Also, she needs to wake up, please. Everything does not seem to be going Franken's way at all lately. It's just been bad news after bad news. Girl, you don't talk to anybody. What are you talking about? Just eat your food and go to work. We're going to try to get this other cooking skill point before work tomorrow. So I guess we'll just make a crap ton of garden salads because we don't have an oven or a stove right now. It's the only thing we can make. That and fruit salads, I think, is the only thing we can make. You don't get any cooking skill points from having like a quick meal or eating snacks. We are not having any fun. So we're going to try to maybe go to the library and play on the computer. She will play on her phone she just doesn't play for very long it does get her fun up but then you have to keep clicking like play game on there we're at the library 
please go in here. Play game. Let's play The Sims, because why not? I love the detail in this game. It looks exactly like The Sims 2. It's so cool. That was fast. Her fun is up already. That's insane. We can talk to a few people while we're here to try to get our social up. Is this a librarian? It is. Okay. We're going to talk to the librarian to get our fun up. I'm sorry, our social up. And then we're going to go home for the evening and maybe cook again. Let's see. Cooking skill. Yeah, we're almost to cooking level skill two. I think if we make one more salad whenever we get home. Is she flirting with us? Wait a minute. So let's try to flirt with her because she's feeling flirty. Ask about woohoo. I didn't know that was a thing. Flirt. Okay, get off the computer, please. Let's see. She is. I'm flattered, but I'm not interested in that type of relationship with you. But I'll be happy if you'd like to be friends. Okay. Complain about fruitcake. We have a lot of feelings about fruitcake, obviously. Go home. Just go to sleep and we'll prob- Oh, we gotta make another salad. Also, we are not gonna have a repeat of Racks at Riches from The Sims 1. I'm gonna buy a trash can because mm -mm, we're not doing this again. I mean, I know she's a slob, but I, I don't think I, I can handle it personally. This is disgusting. Okay, go to sleep. Okay, we're actually throwing stuff away. And we're going to make a salad before work. Hopefully, we'll get us that one last cooking skill point that we need to get promoted. All right, level two. And we finished our daily task. It's the librarian. Kelly McNamara. Playing. Okay, I think you should go for it. Did you already eat? Yeah. You gotta pee, though, but let's take a shower. You can pee at work. We got promoted. Caterer, $11 an hour, making it $28 per hour. Okay, stainless steel auto pot is what she got as her bonus. And then her next shift is Saturday at 3 p.m. Okay, so tomorrow afternoon. Shoot, I didn't see. What's her new schedule? Okay, so she's off Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Okay. All right, let's grab what we got as a career reward here out of our inventory. Stainless steel auto pot. What is it? Coffee maker, I guess? Smooth, sleek, impeccably crafted. Okay, well, it won't go on the counter because we have so much crud on the counter. So let's get another countertop here. Can we get the same one? How much is this? That's $205. These are $150. Let's get different counters. Do we still get the full sale price for these? No. Just a few extra dollars that we earned. Okay, coffee pot and let's get a stove. And a toilet. Can't forget a toilet. Okay, $400 for the stove. And I think we have enough money left over for a toilet. A sink. Oh, we don't. Okay. I'm going to delete this counter because I think I can still make food on this surface with this coffee pot here. If not, I can put the coffee pack back in my inventory. It's not super necessary. I guess it would just be nice to have. We almost have like a full house of furniture. Um, it's not super important to me to have like a TV or anything like that. But I think we're going to stop things right there for now. 
Um, we've made a lot of progress already. We've been promoted twice, like in three days. I mean, it's actually, it's only Friday. We started work on Monday. So we've been promoted twice already, which is super impressive. A lot easier than what this was in the Sims one. We almost have a full house of furniture, like functioning objects. We just have to put a roof over our head, which I think we'll probably be able to do next time when we get promoted. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. It really means a lot to me whenever you take the time out of your day to watch these videos. Make sure you subscribe and like. I'm also on Facebook and Twitter as well too under the same username, Cat's Coffee Sims. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.